so friends we have seen that uh, uh, service services and factory services and in this uh, session we will see the value and constant services example how to make custom services how to use that what are the uh, methods of using custom services so for that reason for that purpose i have already written some line of code which you are very familiar as we have done this uh, many times and so let's uh, uh, check out this code so here i have a title that is angular custom services and then i have the source file for angular.mean.js src file i have included that and then my script block and then my view block that is my html code so uh, let's uh, now we will see about uh, so as of now uh, i have told you that uh, we have uh, many uh, custom services like uh, value services uh, constant services http services service services and factory services so there are uh, many services so we will see uh, each of them one by one so first we will see uh, what is value services okay so let's have uh, let's extend this, this code so i have uh, written a div and inside div i have declared an ng app is equal to l1 and ng control is equal to cntrl and in my script block i have written uh, where desk is equal to angular.module and uh, my ng app name and then a blank array i am passing it okay so now what i will do that uh, i will use a, a value service for that what we need to do is we'll do similarly uh, as we have done with a controller or a filter so this is also a similar kind of syntax that uh, we'll do and it's like uh, desk dot uh, value okay desk dot value and it takes two parameter first one is my uh, value holder name so let's name it uh, uh, weather and second parameter summer i have stored summer variable inside this weather so i can store anything inside this variable okay so but for now i have uh, stored the uh, variable uh, the value summer inside the variable weather and now what i will do is i will inject this uh, variable inside my controller okay so let's make a controller for that just dot controller my controller name that is uh, cntrl and it takes a function parameter and will pass scope and then open close curly braces and my controller definition is done so inside this controller what i will do is i will inject this uh, value uh, variable weather where i will write this i will write this inside the parameter of function that is just after the scope parameter okay so let's write it weather now i will assign this value inside another variable so let's declare a variable say dollar scope dot today's weather and assign here that weather okay so what will happen that uh, when you inject the weather value it will uh, first it will store this uh, value inside this variable weather and when you use this when you inject this uh, value inside your controller this gets available automatically available to you so you can use directly by writing weather you are writing the summer value you are actually assigning this value inside this variable okay so now use this uh, well in your program so head tag to okay we have a syntax uh, missing here it's an extra part 
now save this and run this so friends you can see uh, we have uh, uh, this value somewhere it is coming due to that value service we have we have used in our program so this is all about value service so this is coming due to that value service the value summer is coming and uh, this is all about the value service so here you, it's uh, I think it's uh, clear to you that how to use value service so whatever the value you will write you can uh, use that by injecting that value inside your controller and assigning that into another variable so if you'll change this that is summer is hot then you can see the reflection in your program run it see the summer is hot so whenever you will update you will check that uh, it is automatically updated to your view so friends this is uh, about uh, value service so let's create uh, uh, go to another custom service that is uh, constant uh, service okay so for that reason what we will do is we will change this code little bit it's uh, almost same so just change this to custom constants so now we are seeing uh, what is constant service in AngularJS so for that reason instead of value we will write constant and uh, so in our program there are many uh, situations and uh, circumstances where you need to store some value and you have mm, to use that value in repeatedly in several time in several places so uh, for that reason we use this uh, like uh, constant service so we will store something inside uh, this uh, using this constant service like uh, i am storing here the value of pi okay so here is pi it's 3.14 so now what will happen is i will use this pi i will inject this inside my uh, controller I have injected and now what I will do is I will write uh, something like uh, scope dot area of circle is equal to as we know that area of circle is pi r square so it's a uh, 3.14 into radius so let's say our radius is, is uh, 5 square that is 5 so this is uh, area of circle so this we will get here so we are storing this value 3.14 in pi okay so what we will do we will use that to evaluate the area of circle let's say radius is 5 then what we will do is pi into 5 into 5 so here is the radius so as of now as of now you know that uh, javascript uh, uh, treat this pi value as a string so we need to convert it into integer okay so we'll do parse int or parse float so i have stored this uh, 3.14 in inside into this uh, pi variable and i have uh, used that constant uh, to evaluate the area of circle and i am assuming that uh, my radius is uh, 5 okay so this is the formula for evaluating uh, area of circle that is pi r square so this is my pi value of pi and this is r square that is 5 so pi r square so i have used this uh, uh, pi service inside this controller as a constant service so let's uh, run this uh, program and check uh, what uh, area of the circle is coming on so area of circle of radius 5 is this value okay so let's run this so friends you can see that area of circle of radius 5 is 
so in this way we can use this constant service in our program and uh, you can check that uh, how it is uh, useful and how we can uh, use this in many modules as per the need so friends we have seen that uh, what is value and constant services and uh, in our next session we will see what is filters in angular js